So in this video, we are going to really quick set up Tailwind CSS with our Svelte plus Vite project. It's pretty simple, pretty straightforward. So we already set our project up in the last video. I'll link to that in the description with Vite here in Svelte. And then from there, it's pretty simple. You just copy paste this. Um, let me stop the server, install those three things. After that, you're going to run this command, which will give you a Tailwind dot config dot js and post css to purge um, some of the styles okay so you get this one there we get this one for free and then you just have to add this in we're going to make a little change um, right into here into the purge so it's going to be svelte one two three svelte and then remove these here don't need any of that and then finally we're going to take these right here and create a tailwind css.svelte file and we're going to wrap that in a global style like this put those right there <clears throat> and then all we have to do is import them into our app so import tailwind css from dot slash tailwind .css, and just put it wherever right here like that okay and then if we go to something like tail blocks and we just pull this code right here and I'm just going to get rid of everything we had before and place it right there and let's see if it is working so npm run dev really fast and okay, maybe right there cool and we've got our uh, you can see it's got all of the tailwind uh, styles almost I think yeah, um, and then let's see if we run npm run build, what that looks like, npm run build. Okay, and I forgot to mention last time that there's cache busting, so we get that right there. Let's look in index.css, and it looks like it only included the styles we actually needed. A bit hard to see. Yeah, text in to go 500. Cool, and I think that's all you need to do. If you know a better way to set this up or if there's something I missed, you know, some config here. Anyway, that's the end of the video, and have a great day. Bye.